Hi, lions and lionesses. It's your girl Moniqua, okay? And this is going to be the lunar eclipse in Sagittarius for the Leo Zodiac. Some people say it's happening in Gemini too, but the moon is going to be in Gemini and the opposite sign for Sagittarius is Gemini, so it can go either way. I'm going to just say Sagittarius because it's Sagittarius season, okay? And both eclipses are going to be happening during Sagittarius season, whatever. All right. Sun, Moon, Mercury, Rising, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, North Node, and South Node placements. Please like the video, leave a comment telling me it just resonated with you in any way. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Y'all never had it. <laughs> I'm talking to the women. You gotta burp and you kinda gotta like hold your titties. Like, huh. I'm not used to these, okay? Um, please check the description box for not only my information, but um, my homegirl's information as well. Girl, hold on. Okay. My bad, girl. My bad. Sorry about that. Yeah. Peace. Uh, you know, check the description box for not only my information, my homegirl's information as well. Girl, my hair. I like my fro be girl, but you know, at three days, I'm like, girl, we gotta do something with this. Okay. I'll be tired. All right. Uh oh. Leo, something alarming might be happening over these next few weeks, okay? I heard days, but I was saying weeks because of the eclipse, but I guess days. All right? Uh, like I said, please check the description box for not only my information, my homegirl's information as well. Okay? All of them do sell spiritual merchandise and or products, so hit them up if you would need it. Crystals, head wraps, incense, candles, shea butters, all that, okay? All y'all that's be in the comments asking, you know, drop the skincare routine, it's in the description box. Ari's Body Serum. I promise y'all, that's the only thing that I use on my skin. For my face, I wipe, like, I might, like, put, like, a foam, like, a foam and face cleanser on my face. I use Clean and Clear. That's it. And then I moisturize with her product, with her shea butters, okay? I use it in my hair, too. Girl, it's an amazing detangler, okay? I have an issue with that because I got 4C hair. But, girl, y'all see my skin? Do you see my skin? Girl, look at her. Bitch, I look like I got baby oil, baby oil on 24. Stop behind, okay? I was about to say something. Let me not. All right. So, Leo, let's go ahead and get into y'all how the lunar eclipse is going to be affecting you. Any placement of Leo. All right, let's go ahead and get into it. Spirits, how is the lunar eclipse going to be affecting the Leo zodiac? How is the lunar eclipse going to be affecting the Leo zodiac? Let's see. Karma. Now this could be good or bad, Leo. Okay, so you could you're receiving. No, you're not. Could be. Okay, you're receiving some sort of karma. Like I said, it could be good or bad. Any placement of Leo. Spirits. How is the lunar eclipse affecting the Leo zodiac? Go check out the Gemini reading, y'all. Okay, I'm I'm uploading that first, and then Leo was gonna be I'm up, uploading Gemini on um, Thursday night, and then Leo was gonna be uploaded Friday, midday Friday. Okay, so we got sexual healing. Go check out Gemini reading because they had that too. All right, that shit just flew out, so I guess that wants to you know stay out. Ooh, we're gonna be using Universal. Ooh, girl, twin flames on the bottom. Okay, wealth. So Leos. The karma we are getting. Money. Okay, girl, it's raining from the fucking ceiling. All right, but you're, like, really financially taken care of. Very financially stable. You don't want for nothing. Something just came to mind. I'm going to just fucking say it. You don't want for nothing, but you still feel like something is missing in your life. You got all the money in the world. <sighs> <laughs> like something is missing is it your twin because twin flames on the bottom of the deck girl goodbye and fucking good night okay you know that song Gwen Stefani I've been listening to it for the past few weeks if I was a rich girl na 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 see I have all the money if it were if I was a lucky girl that's not shit I kind of like old Gwen Stefani she was culture appropriating like a mug back then but girl let me not get into that let me not get into that okay I like her her music from the uh, from the early 2000s. All right, spirits. Let's see, Leos, what's going on with y'all? So we got karma, sexual healing, and wealth. All right. So I feel like your karma is good. You're getting money for your karma. All right. But you ain't needed some sexual healing. I think it's from your twin. Fuck him. <laughs> Fuck him. Okay. I don't know, girl, for the women or for the men. Fuck her. All right. I don't know. Do you really feel like that? No. 
spirits okay how is the lunar eclipse affecting the leo zodiac how is the we got a we got a flipper seven of pentacles girl jim and i had the same exact car fly for them too i'm not gonna put it down because i didn't pluck it though okay somebody is waiting to get out of some sort of hard situation they have a lot of responsibilities right now that they're trying to tack on but in the Gemini reading, they was waiting for another paycheck to come in. I feel like um, they've just had a lot of shit to deal with over these past few months, I'm hearing. Um, and they had to get to a space where they're financially comfortable, okay? And I feel like whatever their next payday is coming up, they're going to be okay. Okay, they're going to be in a better financial standing. This could be a Virgo or Sagittarius that feels like this. Spirits, how is the lunar eclipse affecting the Leo Zodiac? Page of Pentacles. I told you, somebody waiting on a little bit of money to come in. They could have just started a new job and they needed to, you know, get some money rolling in consistently. <sighs> Go check out Gemini reading because they had this exact same card too. Whoever this person is, okay, they stalking you, Leo. They watching you, okay? I feel like it's that person, okay? It's at, whoever it is that's waiting is watching you, okay? I think they have a child because I think most of their money is going to, towards, like, taking care of their child, Okay? But they watching you. You don't never leave their site. Like I'm hearing you don't ever leave their browser history. It's like that. Yes. Okay. Because this person feels a lot of regret and shame towards you. Because I just saw the five of cups. It could be a water sign or a Scorpio that's feeling this way about you. Or a Virgo. Spirits, how was the lunar eclipse affecting the Leo Zodiac? Girl, I'm, I'm tired of these flippers. Girl. What does this cancer won't, girl? The moon card. There's somebody who's trying to hide themselves from you or they're trying to keep something from you. Are they trying to keep a woman a secret? Or, Leo, this could be you. Let me see, girl. If I'm going to read it, how the fuck I see it? The Moon card, the Queen of Wands, and the Three of Pentacles. Somebody is trying to keep some sort of financial situation with another feminine energy a secret. Okay? Could be with a Leo, or Aries, a Cancer, or a Capricorn. They trying to keep some sort of financial situation a secret with another woman. Take that how it applies. Okay? You can heard some shit about it, though. Five of Swords. You can heard some shit about it. Okay? But I don't think you have the facts. All right? Let's go ahead and pick a card, y'all. Spirits, how is the Lunar Eclipse going to affect the Leo Zodiac? No, I'm not picking that. Not a source, though. Somebody is really worried right now. Stressing, not sleeping. Is it a man? Because we got King of Swords. Okay, Leo, there's somebody who's trying to act very cold towards you, very nonchalant. They have their back towards you. Okay, they're acting like they can cut you off at any time, so why haven't you? Because the King of Swords goes with the Page of Swords. If you can cut me at any time, why haven't you? Why am I in your history? Why am I in your search box? Just saying, you stalking a bitch and you over here really trying to act like you don't give a fuck? Come on, let's be honest. Spirits, how is the lunar eclipse affecting the Leo? There go that wealth, okay? Girl, who is this man? <laughs> See, this dude is funny. Okay, he moved like an air sign. It is an Aquarius, King of Swords. He moved like an air sign and act like a water sign. So we got Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody is focusing on long-term stability. Somebody is. Then we see the Page of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody is um, a single parent, and they more focused on their long-term stability concerning their child right now. King of Pentacles, they're trying to get in a better, a more um, sound space financially. Three of Wands, because they could have just moved. Okay? Spirits, how is the lunar eclipse affecting the Leo Zodiac? That moon card want to come out. They keeping some shit from you. Okay, they hiding some shit. But you know what's crazy? The moon card and the eight of swords is here. So are they in their own self-delusion? Because it looks like they hiding shit from you. But with the eight of swords, they hiding shit from themselves too. You, The devil card. This person has a lot of um, toxic tendencies about them. That I feel like they try to get, keep hidden. But the universe is like, I mean, who you trying to lie to? Others or yourself? Okay, because people know. People know about you. You really trying to, you know... Con Somebody is really trying to uh, convince themselves. Like, no, I'm not like that. Yes, you is. People know this, too. People can see it, but you acting like you can't. Okay? Spirits, how is the lunar eclipse affecting the Leo Zodiac? Ooh, I'm tired of all these flippers, girl. I ain't picked not one. Page of Wands with the Six of Pentacles on the, on the bottom of the deck. So, somebody has definitely burned a lot of bridges. You see in the background, 
all the damn buildings on fire just because they couldn't com communicate effectively. Six of Is it a man, a cancer, or a Scorpio? Sometimes. Huh. So, yeah, there's somebody who burned a lot of bridges just because they couldn't communicate effectively. I'm hearing somebody could have also got caught up. They was messing with multiple women and they got caught up. Okay. Somebody got caught up. And they just went to, I'm going to just cut everybody off. Okay. Because he really want a Leo. Strength card is here. But, she not, she not fucking with him right now. Queen of Swords is here. But, isn't this a match? King and Queen of Swords, because both of y'all want to talk to each other. It's a Leo. Okay, the Sun card is here. Somebody is also about to go on vacation. The Sun card and the Ace of Swords, I think it's Leo. Leo about to go on vacation. Girl, look at this. Sun and the Moon. There's a Cancer in here, Leo, that you want. Let me just gather up the fucking cards here. Y'all haven't talked. Y'all need to have some sort of conversation, some sort of communication, but somebody got to be willing to give. Okay? Who the fuck that's going to be, okay? Queen of Swords ain't doing it, okay? Girl, she, no, 11-11 when I said that. <laughs> the Libra is not doing that, okay, Leo? You just feel like you're not doing that. Because, like, he acting like he don't like you. You her, okay? Strength, the sun, okay? You here, okay? He acting like he don't like your ass. But he really feel this way about you. He and Cubs, he got a lot of emotions for you. Okay, girl, if you want to act like that, he can act like fucking that, Okay? But I feel like, in general, that's what this person is trying to hide from you. There is somebody else in the picture, though. Queen of Wands. I feel like it's more financial-wise, but we saw her. Like I said, it could be y'all, though, because it's a Leo energy. But it's also an Aries energy. Spirits. How is the lunar eclipse going to affect the Leo Zodiac? How is the lunar eclipse going to affect the Leo Zodiac? Eight of Wands. Three of Swords. Four Pentacles. Somebody has been trying to keep their feelings to themselves, but they want to talk, okay? Somebody could be getting a message that's going to break their heart, okay? Or, that could be a situation. But, with that, that Three of Swords is going with the King of Swords. So, I feel like that man is trying to act cold towards you. He's really in a lot of pain. I feel like he's trying to keep this to himself. He's not trying to show that, but somebody here knows it. Okay. What that mean? When you think the message is going to come from this person, it's not. It's going to come at a completely random time. You ain't going to be expecting it. You saw that shit happen? Okay, eight of wands. When you think the me a message is going to come from this person, it's not. Don't come at another time. I'm hearing it's going to come at night because we got the moon card here. It's going to come at night time. Okay, you might be asleep whenever this person hits you up. Okay, but this man is in a lot of pain right now. He's keeping it to himself, though. Four of Pentacles. Spirits, clarify this King of Swords energy. Clarify this King of Swords energy. Ten of Wands and the Page of Cups. So, like I said, a lot on his plate right now. A lot of responsibilities. Okay, with the Ace of Swords, though. He plans on talking to you. He wants to talk to you. Um, Something about the situation is going to be revealed to you over time. But, no, he's going to talk to you. He's going to send you some sort of communication. Leo! This is you. He's going to send you some sort of communication. You're traveling. Ace of Swords with the Sun card. You're definitely traveling. All right? Um, but with the Page of Cups and the Ten of Wands, he feels a little silly right now. Um, There's something about the situation that he in that puts him in this space of feeling like inferior towards you. But it's emotional-wise. Okay? He kind of just feels like with everything that he has going on, he look like a fool approaching you. I don't know, girl. This is this is how he thinks. We it's the King of Cups. We don't really get too much in that. Why you think like that? Cause that's how King of Cups is, girl. We would stress ourselves out trying to be in his fucking mind space. Spirits, clarify this King of Swords, please. Did I put it back in the deck? I did. Clarify this King of Swords. Well, it was two cards. That's why. Oh, girl, he is stressed, girl. Nine of swords. He can't sleep. Go ahead and watch that Gemini reading. It's the same shit, okay? He can't sleep. Three of pentacles. He's, um... Didn't we see that come out with that queen of wands? That's some sort of financial situation he's involved with with another feminine energy, okay? That stresses him the fuck out, all right? I don't think it goes any further than that, though. He just trying to keep it hidden as the dealings that's really going on, okay? What that situation is really about, Okay? Oh, that's the wax from my candle. I was like, you ever just hear something wet? 
I heard something wet, but I think it was the wax dripping from my candle. Yeah, I got I got crazy hearing, yo. Crazy hearing. Like also smells. Like whenever um let me mm -mm. can't reveal our superpowers, okay, spirits. <laughs> Clarify this King of Swords energy for me. Clarify this King of Swords energy. Page of Pentacles. I told you he was a single parent. And most of his money is having to go to war. taking care of his child. Bitch, I'll be reading the fuck out these cards. Oh my God. The Emperor. Okay? He a father. Single dad. Trying to take care of his child right now. That's where his main focus is right now. Okay? Could have been situations where he wasn't involved. Like, because whenever I see that situation, whenever a man is, like, going, like, full force hard, like, I gotta be a father. You know, like that. There was a period where he wasn't around his son. Okay? So, he's trying to make up for lost time. Right? But he's doing this thing. You know, like I'm saying, like, I don't... I don't ever think he was a bad dad. I just think he was involved in some things that, girl, you know better because you're grown. Emperor, okay. Yeah. Okay. So he's trying to take care of that right now. All right. Because he has this, he has some sort of fear whenever it comes to his son or his child. I think it's a son because it's a page of pentacles. Okay. It looked like a boy. That's why. Like, it looked like a little boy. All right. And we saw the page of wands. So this person might have two sons. Okay. Yeah, there's some sort of fear this man has whenever it comes to his son. All right. Judgment and the just he don't want to lose his child. Did I say there's some sort of fear he got whenever it comes to the son? Some court related going on. I was looking at the king of swords, like, is he, is he in some sort of court case? Yeah, justice in the judgment card. He's getting a ruling favor, okay, but he's still in court. All right, he's still going like back and forth over. It. I'm hearing he still got to sign some sort of paperwork, he still has to um set some sort of um. He got to do some sort of scheduling. He has to set some sort of schedule, some sort of monthly schedule. He got to um, have that ready by the uh, beginning of December. Yeah. And he more concerned with that, girl. Libra and Scorpio. We can't be mad at that, okay? He still thinks about you. Can't, Leo, there's a cancer in here who you think about and think about you, okay? He still think about you, though. Oh, girl. Yes. Sexually? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I think, you know, with him being in daddy mode 24 fucking 7, he ain't had no mommy and daddy time. It ain't got to be with the mother of the child. He just ain't had no mommy and daddy time. Okay? Spirits, clarify this king of swords. Clarify this king of swords, please. And I say he ain't had no mommy and daddy time. Okay? We got the empress here. Okay, but the Ace of Cups is on the bottom of the deck. So, and the Ace of Pentacles. And the Three of Swords, girl. And the Chariot. All right, let's go ahead and see what we got going on here. So, so we've seen the Empress and the Queen of Wands. There's two feminine energies up in here. All right, so there's one uh, person who he has a child with. Um, Because he's a single parent, he might not be with the mother of the child. All right, there's one person who he has a child with. Okay, and there's one person who he kind of... um. He wants to get pregnant? Because the Empress is here. He, like, he sees it as somebody that he already going to get pregnant. Like, he already knows she's a prime candidate, okay? Okay. 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 There's somebody who he knows he wants, okay? Empress, complete package for him. He feels like that's a complete package. Could be a Taurus or a Libra. All right? Ace of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups. Like, he sees, like, not only does he see love with this person, he sees wealth. That Empress, he knows, is very abundant. Okay? He knows that Empress is very abundant. So, not only does he see love, he sees money with this person as well. But with the Three of Swords here, yeah, he put her in some sort of third party. Yeah, he put her in some sort of third party. Okay? But he had to choose. He had to choose. He had to choose between two people. He chose a Leo. The five of wands is here. He chose a Leo, but he not he he hasn't revealed that yet. Cause the Knight of Pentacles is here. He hasn't revealed that yet. Cause he still feel a little silly. I don't know what for, a girl. Probably because he need to talk to her. Okay, cause the Ace of Swords is right below it. But he's chosen. 
he just ain't let it be he, he hasn't let it be known yet okay yeah he 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 want to get somebody pregnant spirits clarify this moon card spirits clarify this moon card these things is being hidden that shit really want to come out ace of swords so moon card ace of swords and a justice card so i feel like he might still be waiting on some sort of uh, ruling and some sort of court case. He gonna get a rule in favor because I feel like that's his karma. He deserves this. Okay, karma. Justice. He deserves this. With the judgment card, he's gonna get a rule in favor in court. I just feel like it hasn't been revealed to him yet. It's still being hidden from him. And he feels like he can't communicate with whoever this woman is until he gets that ruling. Okay, because then he'll know like, okay, I ain't got no baggage. I'm good. I'm not bringing nothing unnecessary towards her. We like that ace of swords here okay but there's going to be some sort of communication all right he's been worried about talking to this woman too why girl, why is he so worried girl he love her they go that damn cancer okay two of cups he really love her okay he do spirits clarify this moon card spirits clarify this moon card see this is the bullshit we be talking about all right this person was hiding the fact that they was juggling you with um somebody else. Okay. I feel like it was having to do with their son, though. There was some sort of third party that they now have on block. Okay, Leo, don't get your panties in a bunch, girl. Because, you know, I do feel the fire rising up. Okay, like, girl, girl, go ahead. Go ahead and light them fucking candles for his ass. Okay, but that, here's the situation. Yes, this person was uh, juggling with you. Oh, girl, <laughs> he tried to choke my ass. Like, no, nigga, I'm say it, okay? This person was, uh, they was juggling you with somebody who I feel like they was juggling you with the mother of their child. Or you had a child with this person, they was juggling you with just some bitch, some random ass hoe. All right. Three of Cups is here, some third party, all right? A Cancer was doing this, or a Capricorn. But they blocked whoever it was, okay? Seven of Wands, they blocked that third party, and now Four of Cups, they missing the person who they put in the third party. Now they like, well, shit, I should have never chose the third per person. <sighs> he stresses us out. All right. Spirits, clarify this moon card, please. Clarify this moon card. Page of Wands. With the Page of Swords, that man's stalking the hell out of you, Leo. High Priestess, and you know it. Girl, you fucking know it, okay? Here's the deal. I said in the Gemini uh, reading, this person stalks you. They do a real good job of stalking you because they don't leave a trail. They don't leave a fucking trail. Page of Wands and the Page of Swords. Here's the situation. This person makes it look like, I don't know what they have going on in their life. We haven't talked in ages. I don't know what's going on with them. Nighttime roll around. They in this energy. High prison, the page of swords. They're researching your zodiac. They looking up what happens whenever you mad and why you not talking to them. Motherfucker might know where you live and he be riding past your house at night. For what? What you trying to find out? You not talking to me, but you trying to figure out what the fuck. You weirdo. Okay, like girl, spend all that time fuck stalking my ass, but will not talk to me. Ah. Uh, he gonna talk to you though. <laughs> he gonna talk to you soon. Okay, but I feel like he he. Ooh, girl, this this man. He just be wanting to like his situation. He feel like he can't find everything out from just like watching you. So what he'd rather do, okay, is find out for himself. Like he'd rather just see like what he can see for himself. What you I'm hearing like cause if he watching you, it's probably social media, right? So he does his physical stalking to find out things he can't find out on social media. Like, for instance, where you live, where you work, where do you frequent? High priestess, though, I feel like y'all and both, y'all stalked each other in some sort of way. You saw him out, you stalked him, he saw you out, he stalked you. It's a vice versa energy. Spirits, clarify this moon card for me. Clarify this moon card for me. Eight of Swords and the Knight of Pentacles. So, right now, he doesn't know what to say to you. He wants to say something to you. Um... Yeah, he's in this court case right now. He's in this court case right now. Okay, Ace of Cups. He knows that he loves you. Ace of Cups with the Two of Cups. He knows that he loves you. Oh, he loves you so much. And that water park, girl. Oh, girl, he can't get that water park out of his mind, okay? No, for real. Like, he's just like, no one. I 
like no one does it like that okay because remember he was out there at one time we don't care girl nobody that he tasted was his flavor so okay <laughs> enjoy all right um i'm telling you this man be doing stuff at night that you don't know about he stalk you in some way that you don't know about. We can see the knight and the high priestess. The knight of pentacles and the high priestess are two of the same people. They cut from the same cloth. A knight of pentacles just moves more in a 3D way. Okay, a high priestess, she all about spirituality. A knight of pentacles, he's still a little toxic. Okay? Spirits, clarify this eight of wands. Because that's some sort of message. Okay? Clarify this eight of wands. One of y'all, yo, oh, y'all need some sexual healing. Right when I fucking said that, the Ace of Wands came out. And it's going with the Eight of Wands. You know who need the sexual healing more, though? The man, that father. Oh, girl, he is so pent up. The Emperor in the Tower, girl. Listen, listen, listen. Let's, 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 let's talk about it real fast. Oh, girl, he want to stroke the hell out of you, girl. Like, it's going to be like this. tragedy oh like rock okay like he he like he ain't had sex in a while i'm seeing that as that he ain't had sex in a while okay tower he's about to erupt okay he's literally about to erupt okay he about to lose control the emperor and tower car he about to lose control of himself okay because he wants to have some sort of gemini Gemini reading. He wants to have some sort of new beginning with you, some sort of spark. He already has that for you. Ace of Swords and the Ace of Wands too. So, um, Leo's this eclipse is going to be bringing you some sort of new experience, some sort of new communication from this person that's being hidden from you. Um, this could, this communication could be coming around the full moon because the Ace of Swords is right on top of the moon card. Yeah. Okay. But he wants to come to you like a wrong man. Like he like he don't want to come to you like no kid, okay? Because he doesn't have kid things on his mind. Emperor and the Empress, this your man, one hundred grand. We won't deny it. You know what, Leo? I'm sick of you. <laughs> yeah, this your man, girl. He already got a child, okay? Or two kids. Um, or you might already have a child, Leo. Both of y'all are already, one of y'all already got a kid. Okay, there's already a kid in play here, right? Kid in play? Oh, did you see the foot? Girl, okay. Spirits, clarify this eight of wands. Ooh. Beach. Beach. Leo, you already know about this though. High priestess, you already know this message is coming, okay? Because you haven't gotten a reading on this man. You got a reading on him. Okay, anyway. Ten of Pentacles, though. Like, your karma is your money is overflowing. Also, you're going on vacation. Four of Wands, you're going to be very relaxed during this time. So, we got Eight of Wands and the Four of Wands. So, I feel like, girl, it's weird. Because it's like, right around the time you're going on vacation, you get a message from this person. Okay, and Knight of Cups, he like, girl, I want to go. Knight of Cups, he like, I want to go. Okay, you see the bottom, though? I want to go. Is that him and his dick saying that? I want to go. I'm just saying, girl. He, you know, he has that thing on his mind. Okay? And he's like, I want to go. But like, I'm just picking up somebody. just like, I want to go with you. You know, like, but it's kind of like a naughty type energy. Like, neither because he's like, can I go with you? You know? Innocent, but you know what the real is behind what he's saying. Last card. Spirits, clarify this Eight of Wands for me. High Priestess and the Ace of Wands with the Eight of Wands. And the Nine of Pentacles I just saw, but I didn't pluck it. Okay, so somebody is very financially taken care of, like I said. Eight of Cups and the Knight of Swords. Somebody has walked away from you, but they've been in and out. They walk away from you, they come back. They walk away from you, they come back. Spirits, clarify this Eight of Wands for me, please. Clarify this Eight of Wands for me. Leo, is that man... I don't know if he going with you, but I think he going to spend a night out there with you. Night of Wands. This is a one-nighter. Somebody spend a night with you, girl. I don't know when, but somebody is spending the night with you sooner or later. Okay? Night of Wands and the Six of Wands. Leo, this is you. Night of Wands is a Sagittarius, but this is definitely you, Leo. Who that in your car that you trying not to let nobody know about? 
Girl, why he like he too big for the car? <laughs> he kind of like he too big for the car. You taking somebody. Somebody going with you. You Y'all keeping it real low key. High Priest is here. You keeping it a secret. Okay. Just because it's like, it's really spontaneous. Okay. He texts you or she hits you up. I want to go. Knight of Wands. Can I, can I come? Never. Okay. Cancer Energy. Four of Cups. Okay. You might reject this person. Like, no, you can't fucking come. Okay. <laughs> Will you, though? You see how that shit just flew out? The Wheel of Fortune. Okay. There's some sort of faded event. Like, some sort of timing that's happening here. Though, where it's like, there's a fade event. Okay. High Priest and the Wheel of Fortune. You've seen this already. You've seen this happen already. Okay. There's a certain deja vu here. All right. But Leo, you going on vacation, and I think you're going to have the option to take this person. Or this person is going to be hitting you up while you're on vacation. They're hitting you up like around the moon time. And I feel like they're really going to be hitting you up like around the time the eclipse takes place. Remember how we saw the sun and the moon? Leo, there's a cancer in here. Girl, just pack up the cards. I'm going to put it back in the box, okay? <laughs> Leo, that was your tarot reading for the lunar eclipse. How it's going to be affecting your zodiac signs, sun, moon, Mercury, rising, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, north, north, south, no placements, all right? Please like the video, leave a comment telling me it just resonated with you in any way. Subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Instagram at Monique the Mystic with two Y's. DM me on there if you like a personal tarot reading. My availability is going to be open from November 30th. No, it's going to be closed. Okay, it's going to be closed starting November 30th. It's going to be open until November 30th um, through December 5th. All right, so you can't get a personal tarot reading from me until December 6th. All right? Girl, I ain't got time for it. <sighs> okay, Leos. All right, like I said, always check the description box for my homegirls of businesses page. Businesses pages. Okay, business pages. All right, and the pin comment in the comment section. I'm dropping Gemini tonight. All right, I'm going to go slide through my mama crib and come pick this food up. Yes, all right. All right, Leos. Bye.